Welcome to the DMZ. Today, we're looking to do something a little interesting. Today, we're gonna have to sneak into Suki Castle and solo the boss. But before we do that, we need to get all the way over to here to grab a radio transmitter. I think the best way for me to do that is going to be to swim around or I guess more so take this jet ski around. I've also brought in the new gun. We got a nice Tempest build. Oh. Okay, I wanted to make sure those weren't players. Ooh, we gotta move. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna swim way out here because some people could snipe me from the beach. So we're just gonna distance ourselves really far. I even hear a sniper, you see that? That is definitely not AI. AI is not going to shoot me that far. Not a chance. Real players, 100%. And you know what, normally I would probably go kill them for doing that to me, but we have our own business to attend to, so we're gonna stick to the mission. Now, what we need to do is head over to here. That's our spot right there. We're gonna need to go in quietly though, because we're making a lot of noise out here. And a lot of players get attracted to you in the start when you're driving boats and things like that. That's okay, we got plans. It's not our first time. I really like to dock boats right up here. I'm gonna scope out the area. We know there's probably some spawns around here. What I'm gonna do, dive down under. Oh, didn't know I'd have to go over that wall there. All right, so we're gonna work our way over here because this is where we need to get the item from the dead drop and then we'll work our way into the tunnels. Let's see, do we have any good UAV towers? No, we don't. We do have a store here, and that's actually really helpful because I'm gonna need some plates. Especially since I'm gonna have to go in and solo the bomb maker. Let's see. Alright, this thing's pretty nice, you guys. It's like a two-shot AI kill on average, which is pretty good. Ah, HVT. That's why it's so hot AI-wise right now. Makes sense. That is usually the case. We also have a variable scope here, as you can see, that I can toggle between. These got buffed in the patch, you guys, and these are super good now. I'm gonna be uh, talking about that at some point later on. Dang, really hoping to find... Uh-oh, the AI chopper is freaking out, as it does pretty often these days. Look at that five attachment gun from the AI. That's actually amazing, you guys. These AI are getting really noisy. Ooh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. We're gonna reposition. I still don't have really... Oh, I do have money for plates. Uh-oh. Well, we're gonna have to take the risk here. Just gotta stay sharp. Okay, let's move. Alright, we got what we need. I know I dropped an ammo box back there, but I'm more concerned about speed right now. Since somebody popped the UAV, they definitely potentially have my coordinates. As a solo, that's not a comforting feeling. So I'm gonna get to moving right now. What we gotta do next is swim into the underway. What we're gonna do is we brought in the Suki Castle key so that we can go and come into Suki Castle from the safest place. Five, we wanna be quiet while entering in here not to attract players in. That's why I'm swimming down here and trying to hide from the AI as best as possible.
Barely making it up here. We want to be quick about this. Okay, now let's kill what AI we need to. Alright. Oh, that's a juggernaut. This thing destroys the juggernaut. Wow. That gun's actually incredible at taking out the juggernaut. Probably one of the best weapons I've ever seen at taking out the juggernaut, in fact. This gun gets a huge plus in my book for that. All right. This thing has got to be one of the best AI killers in the game, you guys. This gun is really impressing me. I've leveled it up and tested it out, and I got a good build for it. But this is the first time I've used it um, as a means of being in DMZ with it. All right. Here we go, y'all. It's going to get spicy. Oh, God. All right. Well, we got to look out for those. <laughs> Hate riot shielders with a passion. Those are my, uh, those are the most painful AI for me, you guys. Riot shielders, mm, don't like them. I don't like them. Now I'm out of grenades, so, you know, we'll see how this goes. I am going to go ahead and put a trap down here, actually. Just in case some other players show up. I'll know, at least. Just a way to be careful. Was that? Okay, that's not what I'm looking for. All right, let's definitely get ourselves more Simtex. I'm sure we'll run into some more ride shielders. Let's pick our way up. Let's just take things slow, no rush. Yeah, this thing tears through AI, you guys. Amazing. Truly amazing. Okay. Just kind of loot as we go here. Let me take things slow. There's traps around. I don't know what's wall banging me. That's interesting. Oh, oh, we got a riot shielder. Stick him and move. There we go. Yeah, I don't know what's shooting me through there. Ooh, I actually wasn't ready for this turret. Go ahead and break that down. I do think there's another turret over there. Let's see, there's no trap here. Okay, let's get our plates on here real quick. Strike the top here in hopes to kill the bomb maker through the roof. That's our goal. It's possible, though it's not super consistent. Nice and slow, nice and slow. Nice and slow. Let's reload this thing. All right. Oh, there's the bomb maker. Hold on a second. Let's go and get our plates up. Now we're not gonna grab the weapons case. I've already done all of mine. So that's not something we need. So fortunately that's out of the way. Okay, now we plant the radio transmitter right there. Boom, we've got that done. Beautiful. And let's see if we can loot up a little here. I'm gonna take a dead silence because I don't have anything in place of that right now, so that'll help. It does sound like somebody is out there fighting the commander he loves, so that's quite interesting. Um, a key, I mean, I guess I'll take it. I'll probably end up dropping it. I don't really have any true use for it. All right, we still got ammo in this thing. Let's, ah, oh, 
Dang it, you know, I saw it last second, you guys. I saw it last second. Oh, man. Oh, you know what? We're just gonna go, we're just gonna go the way we, uh, the way we can. I'm just gonna go this way. Actually, I want oh, grenade? There. Yeah, I'd like to have a grenade with me. I'll take a smoke grenade, too. Could come in handy. All right, let's get to moving. Don't need anything there. I came from here? Yeah, I definitely came from here. And this way. Here we are. Perfect. Let's see. Where are our exfils here? So we could we could travel this way and exfil over here. That's a good exfil because I can cover it with a UAV tower. So I think that's what we're going to do. I don't know if exiting through there is my best option, though. Whatever. We're going to do it. Just because a lot of people regain down here, you know? Right here. Okay, it's still closed. So that's good news. It's actually good news. The fact that it's still closed is great. Okay, let's go ahead. Armor up. Yeah, we gotta be careful around here. Oh, my. Okay, that's, that's not fun. Where is he going? Okay, we're just gonna run. We're just gonna dip and dodge. There we go. You bob and weave. Juggernaut, no problem. That's something else you guys might notice that I do against AI quite a bit if you pay a lot of attention. I actually run past a lot of AI. Um, that is actually one of the best ways to deal with them. Believe it or not. It's very effective. Let's go ahead and reload this thing. Ah, I can hear them fighting the commander Elo. Let's see. Okay, let's give it a hold breath here. There we go. Uh oh, didn't expect you there. Oh, wow, what? Okay, that that shocked me. All right, the juggernaut just kind of one tapped me there, you guys. That's kind of crazy. That's kind of crazy. At least we got another self revive in the backpack. Now, wh what angle did this guy? Oh, he's, oh, there's another Juggy. Okay, I didn't know that. Oh, he's angry. Oh, he's very angry. Got him. All right. Do you have anything useful for me? Yeah, go figure. He doesn't. What a surprise. Looks like we're out of ammo for that, so we're going to go ahead and switch to this, even though I really want to keep using it. So I will say the one thing I would say about um, the new gun is its biggest downside is definitely ammo. From what we've seen here already, you can tell its biggest downside is most definitely ammo, um, which is OK. You can just make sure to stow extra sniper rounds in your backpack. That's definitely something to, you know, be uh, aware of. Okay, now we need to get to that UAV tower, because that UAV tower is going to keep us safe. So let's work on doing that. Alright. What the? Wow, okay, that was a buggy AI. Alright, let's take control of this. People in Ashika can be a bit hostile sometimes. Okay, nobody's near me at the moment. That's great stuff, guys. That's great stuff. All right, let's clear the few AI around here out. Man, you guys, this thing is a, is a machine against AI. I definitely, definitely advise this gun um, for dealing with AI players. I'll need some more time with it um, to see, but I do believe it's good. If you guys have seen my buddy Sinister's videos, I think he got some trial and error done against uh, players with this thing, and I think he had, he had some good success with it. So I think it's good there as well. Be with you soon. 
I fortunately haven't had to deal with any this round. And honestly, we'll take that. Because I only had one Ashika key left. So, you know, it'd be kind of a pain if I died. Alright, alright. We got some smoke grenades for our exfil. Can come in handy. Now, our radar only extends so far, so somebody could definitely, like, try to spot me from this area and try to kill me that I wouldn't see coming. That's also why I grabbed the smoke grenades earlier. Looks like we got a pretty nice exfil here. Just make sure we don't get sniped from somewhere. And we're gonna be alright. I'm gonna go ahead and throw a smoke over there. And I'm gonna go through and throw smoke over there to cut off just this area over there that I'm worried about. And let's get on out of here, you guys. Woo! Hey, what's shooting at me there? All right, all right, you guys. Not bad, not bad. Really quick, clean, easy, you know, solo commander kill, as well as completing our mission here eyes and ears. This is a tier 4 black mouse. I would say it's not too bad. You're just going to have to be really careful, right? It definitely makes it a lot easier if you have an Ashika Isle or an Ashika Hideout Castle key, right? If you don't, obviously you can go and you can kill the robot that's out in the courtyard, hack him and come in through that. But as you guys saw, if you have the key and you can come from the underground, it's going to make that mission a ton easier. So I hope this helps you guys when you guys get to this mission, because this is what I believe is the best and easiest way to make it on you for doing this mission. All right, you guys, so for this Tempest tour and build, what we have is the hybrid Firepoint optic. Now, if you guys don't know, dual optics got buffed. Their ADS time has been reduced by 45%. So you ADS significantly faster, making these way more viable than they were in the past. I strongly recommend you try the hybrid firepoint as well as other dual optics as well this is the one that i have tested and felt the best to me next we then have the chroma lrs this has a suppressor built in it also gives us damage range and bullet velocity which is exactly what the tempest torrent needs after that we have the lock grip position now this thing while it doesn't state in the stats here, it actually is one of the best recoil attachments in the game. If you check things like true game data and stuff, you'll see that that is the case. After that, we've got high velocity rounds with this tuning right here. Notice I tune a lot towards damage range on all of these attachments, and that's because the Tempest Torrent really needs it. It has quite a significant damage fall off, so if you go and tune towards damage, it's going to help that a lot. So you can use it at longer ranges and, be, and it still be viable. And then lastly, we have the 50 round drum mag. Hope you guys appreciated this. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Helps the algorithm, helps me. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.